My hair is wet and my tongue is burnt. What a great way to start a video. It's been burnt all day. And as if you actually care about my well-being, I'm going to tell you how it happened. All right, so yesterday I was cooking up some Easy Mac. And first of all, I want to point out that Easy Mac has been made easier. Yeah, I know all you had to do before was measure some water, put it in the microwave, and then you're good to go. You don't even have to do that anymore. They come in these little cups. You just put water in that and then plop that in the microwave. You don't even need to measure anymore. It's Easier Mac. So I was doing that. And as I was about to indulge in cheesy goodness, I realized it was probably too hot for me. But it was too late. I already committed to the spoonful. Put in my mouth. Bad decision. I mean, it tasted amazing. Amazing, but it ripped my taste buds to shreds. So even after that immense pain, I wasn't even able to enjoy the rest of the cheesy goodness that is that Easy Mac that I had made because it's so good. And my tongue is still burnt. And it's not like it hurts, it's just annoying. I have like a layer of dead taste buds on my tongue. Just gross. And that's just one of my pet peeves. When something amazing goes horribly wrong and can injure you or lead to awkward situations. Which is an amazing transition for my next thing that I'm gonna talk about now. So those of you out there who know me in person will know that I am a hugger. Freaking love hugs. They're just amazing. Just embracing another person. I don't know why dudes don't hug. Like, what is that? We can't show affection to each other? What's up with that? I hug people all the time. But anyway, I'm going off on a tangent. This is a very tangential conversation we're having right now. Yeah, hug. So I was in this public place, and somebody from across wherever I was, because I don't remember where that was, obviously recognizes me for some reason. I don't recognize her. I have no idea who this person is, but obviously they know me and remember me from something. Probably YouTube, because, you know, we're huge. No. But anyway, she starts coming at me, you know? Just coming at me like we're about to have this amazing conversation like we haven't seen each other for years, which is probably the case because I have no idea who this person is. So she comes closer and closer and closer and for a greeting I thought we were gonna like high five or wave or something. But no, she goes in for the hug and I realized she was going in for the hug too late because she was already like a foot away from me, already arms out. And at that point there's no turning back. You can't just pull a Houdini and like duck under her and just grab her hand and shake her like that because then that makes you look like you don't want to hug the person. And it's not like I didn't want to hug the person, I just didn't know who they were. So yeah, she's just coming at me and the world's going in like slow motion at this point, trying to decide what I should do and just mulling over the possible consequences of each choice. Just a highly stressful moment in my life. So rather than avoid the inevitable, I just went for it. I hugged her. I mean, she was hugging me, so it wasn't like she was like, whoa, why'd you hug me? Why'd you do that? I wasn't hugging you. I mean, if she did that, that would just be cold. Put me through that torment and then force me to hug you for nothing. Yes, yeah, so it was one of the most awkward hugs of my life, because again, I didn't know who this person was. And it was just one of those awkward moments that's just so painfully awkward, and there's no way to get out of it without making yourself look like a jerk. And I really wish I knew who this person was, because I'm not one who will pass up a hug. That pretty much does it for today, this lovely Wednesday. So me and my deep V sweater are gonna get off of here. As always, this Friday is gonna be Rant Friday, so if you want me to rant on something, freaking comment that below, and I may or may not do it. Also, go down to that pants bar, click them links, and freaking enjoy them. And I did post a cover of Animal by Neon Trees on my second channel. If you want to see me do that, you go down to that pants bar and enjoy, ladies. <laughs> what? But I am going to get off of here. And as always, I'm Connor Manning, and you've just become a little more awesome. See you guys on Friday. Wah! Ugh. See ya.